Hi everybody and welcome to my Chess 24 series, Miss Strategy Teaches. This is a very special edition where the teacher won't be me, but the famous guest. We have with us Grandmaster Arthur Cogan, a very prestigious trainer who has coached several top players like Nakamura, like Mangliam and Rajabov. Thank you for joining the show, Arthur. My pleasure, Anna. What will we see? What strategic idea will you teach us? Well, I was thinking to show something about the close position, close system that's called the Czech Benoni. And, um, Starting like this, basically, right? And uh, close positions are well known to be harder for uh, for study, yeah. And uh, I think this is a quite a good example to show that even when you have lack lack of space, you can still find nice plans. Uh, of course, being close position, you have to use some pawn breaks ideas and maneuvering pieces. This is the trick, Anna. So, what maneuvers uh, shall we find? Them? What about the knight? Okay. <laughs> So the knight, one of my tricks when I was playing this system was that I tried to save time and bring the knight before castling. Using that the center is closed, I don't have to hurry to castle. I really like this idea because as you say, once we castle, we take the square from, uh, from the knight. The f8 square is now occupied. So you actually don't castle, you bring the knight to g6 immediately. Exactly. Nice since idea. my king is not in danger, I can still wait a little bit. Yes, and since I have lack of space in that side of the board, I want to create attack on that side. Right. Very logical. Now what about the bishops? Okay, and the bishops, yes. Well, this bishop is already playing from his own place, mm -hmm. you know. It's, uh, well, and this one is quite a poor one. This one is a poor one, yes. <laughs> so what I'm trying to do later on, some ideas like this sometimes, creative way to change it for the good bishop. Mm -hmm. Or even in that way, that is more aggressive. So I might even hope to get my knight here. Or even the Olala way, <laughs> yes, to make it smile in some funny way as I did in some of my games like this. And this might be included sometimes, for example, ideas of sacrificing here. If White Castle is kingside, uh, might be in trouble with these sacrifices. Exactly. I really like this, the knight maneuver and how to how to recycle the bishop because on e7 is not doing anything. Exactly. Make your pieces smile. That's the trick. Very nice idea. I'm sure you learned a lot from this video and of course you should check some games. So we recommend Arthur's games in this opening which you can find in the article. So if you are watching this on YouTube, please go to the description and click on the link to find Arthur's games on this opening, the model games we want to show you. Um, I think I'm gonna play this too. I, yeah. I like these maneuvers, especially the knight maneuvers and if there's some kind of a knight h4, I mean knight h5 and knight f4, I think I should play this opening. You should too. try, yes. I should add only that also this pawn break is very important in some lines. And I really recommend you to see my creative game against uh, Lazarev, where I managed even to get my rook, if you can imagine, all this way to b7. Quite Seriously. fun. Seriously. <laughs> but his king was cast along. Okay, that's the difference. So to find that game, click on, click on the link. And uh, we really wish that you, you win a lot of games for this opening. Good luck, everybody. <laughs>